currently watching. We're heading down now to the sanctuary. Hi, all you crazy cats and kittens. <laughs> um, okay, so we're on mobile data. So I don't know if it will work or not, but we're going to move. So the picture will be rubbish. And then uh, we'll put the camera down and it should get it better. should settle, yeah. Let's start off with Mufasa. Okay. Hopefully a few more people will start to join us soon. We've got, oh, 18 people watching. Hello, 18 Hello, people. Hello, everyone. Hi, Jenny. How are you doing? Dogs. Oh, well, here we go. We could start there. With the dogs? Start with the dogs. Yeah. Come on, then. We're, gonna, we're trying something new with mobile data so we can actually show you some more of the animals rather than just our ugly mugs. Uh, speak for yourself. Yeah. Hey, come on. It's kind of getting like a little, little bit of a tour of the sanctuary. Oh. Wait. So I don't know how Wait. good the picture is. Wait. Sorry. Okay, I've got that. <gasps> Hello. Hello. Do you want to say hi? I'm gonna put the camera down. Yeah. And then um you wanna Yeah, extend. I'll extend it. Hello. Okay, that should start to get clearer. Oh hi from Suffolk. Well in Garden City, Hertfordshire. Hi. Hi from Suffolk. This is Goaty, everyone. Hello. Oh, boy. Picture is good. Good. Oh good. Excellent. So Goaty we um rescued in 2018. <laughs> Come here, little man. <laughs> he we were um we'd actually that same morning we'd found six abandoned puppies. And we were driving around to see if we could find um, a mother because they'd just been left at the side of the road. And uh, we were driving around for quite a while, didn't have much luck and we kept coming back to the sanctuary. It was about 11 at night so it was dark and we saw him on the side of the road and we thought he was a goat at first. And we were just shocked at how skinny he was and he had a big tumour hanging off his chest. It took us about an hour to catch him the road was quite busy so it was um, quite dangerous and we were getting uh shouted at and yeah, bibbed bibbed at. At. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, we eventually managed to veer him off the road and onto like a farm track Hello. and uh julian sort of went around the back of him and herded him towards the car and he just sort of walked towards the car and then stopped i think maybe because the headlights couldn't see anything and i managed to reach out and grab him he had like a chain on with a broken um piece of rope and we put him in the back of the car and he just fell asleep. He was um, exhausted. And we had a lot of problems with him um, to get him up to health. Uh, there were like infections in his um, gums and... Yeah, all here. Um, this was all black and uh, yeah, it was really... He was in a real bad state and he's... Diarrhea because oh, he hadn't He was eaten so properly. skinny, wasn't he? He was skeletal. He was 17 kilograms um, when we rescued him. Um, then he got up to 27 kilograms in, I think, about five months or something. And now he's um, a little bit less again because he's got uh, this leash disease, um, so that can make them lose weight. But he's about 25 kilograms now, but um, yeah, a lot better than he was when we found him. And it, it took him a little while, he was very nervous to begin with, um, but it took him a little while to get to, to know us and to trust us. Come on yeah, then, are you coming in? Really friendly now. You coming in? Django! Come in, Django. Serious! Come here, come and say hello. Come here. Come on. <laughs> Serious! Come on! He's a bit uh Serious is a bit nervous of men still. Come here! Serious! Come here! Good boy! I'll sit over here and then. <laughs> Sunny. No, I didn't like it. Sunny. <laughs> up, up. Where are the comments gone, guys? How come we can't get them up? 
I don't know. That button? Oh, oh, there we go. He still looks like a goat, yeah. And he's really stunk like goat as well. We think he maybe came from a goat farm, either escaped or was abandoned, not sure. But it's likely that he was a hunting dog. Is eyebrows there? She's um, not. She's in. She sleeps at a different part at night because she barks um, during the night otherwise. So she sleeps with Barney. And Barney was out, but he started being a bit naughty and like chasing the cat, so I put him to bed. <laughs> Serious, come here. Come here. No, he doesn't want to know. Come here. He doesn't want to know. Yeah, you, you know the cuddle. Sonny. Sonny. Come here, baby. Sonny. Come on. Hello. Come here, honey. Good girl. Oh, so this is Sonny, and uh, we've had Sonny uh, for a good few years now. Oh, now he's coming to say hello. Oh, hello. Now you want to say hello? <laughs> it's serious and sunny. <laughs> That's because Sonny's here. And Sonny was found um, wandering the streets. And uh, we got her from down. But actually, she went down to a storm drain. So we got her out of there. And she was in a bit of a bad state. And um, She was only about six months old. Yeah. We think that maybe she was something to do with fighting or something like that but yeah, she's a beautiful yeah, beautiful girl yeah. really good and very really intelligent she's beautiful she's just very Hola from um, portugal hi from washington hello. state what a great way to start my day mm. you guys are just amazing yeah. oh thank you very much katrina yeah sunny's very reactive when she goes out on a walk um we think it's a bit of fear aggression so cars she goes mad at cars she goes mad at strangers so it's quite a thing to walk her um yeah she's difficult <laughs> watch him he's been rolling in poo yeah it. i was just gonna say there's a <laughs> quite a dodgy smell coming from you django hmm. serious and serious serious doesn't want to know should we move to another Who's location yeah where should we go next guys where, who do you want to go and see next mufasa or barry and the goats maybe Let's hi from ohio greetings from grandma linda in martinsburg <laughs> hi Hot Barcelona. Yeah, Jane, hasn't it been hot today? Hot it's been today. crazy today. The goats. Okay, goats Barry and, and Barry. Goats. It That's... sounds like Barry and the goats. Barry and the goats. Yeah, it's like a band. Okay, come then. Let's go and see <laughs> Barry and the goats. Right, doggos. See you later, guys. Be good. Then lay down. I'm going to grab the camera. Okay, so yeah. I might get a bit bad quality as we're moving. It should stabilise again once we stop. Oh, we're taking the smelly dog with us. Probably. This is our poo trailer. You might like to see this. <laughs> uh, in here, this is a little trailer that we've got where we put all the dog poo and the cat poo and things like that. And then we go and empty it once a week. So, oh, I know. And a broken down car that needs to go. Yeah, the um, broken down car that's sat there that's become like years. a shed. Yeah. We've tried to fix it, but it's too too expensive to fix, so it's got to go. Julian, what's on your T-shirt? Uh, this is uh, Adidas. The T-shirt's a little bit too small for me, but it's my. It's just for working in the field. But it's Adidas, and they're all different trainers. I don't know what they say on them. I've uh, never really looked at it, actually. They've got countries on them. It looks like it's from... Oh, like World Cup football or something. Something like that. Yeah, I don't know. Different years and marathon. It was my little brother's t-shirt <laughs> and uh, he gave it to me, so. Oh, thank you very much, Simone. Thank you, Simone. I start looking a little bit, dull. I was thinking about <laughs> doing it for uh, the goats actually, but then I start. It just ends up looking a bit, I think if Could everything's. Could you imagine what it would look like? Let's get rid of this. Stuff. If everything's all neat and tidy and everything, then it might look okay. But if things are a little bit messy then it'll just make things look more chaotic right we're gonna go and see barry now so we enter in here i've not got the right shoes on for this no me neither i've got my flip-flops on uh, so we'll go out because it'd be go out? Better. yeah go out there into that area where it's a bit open um come on then Mind out, Baz. Back up. Back up. Back up. Good boy. Good boy. Hi, Philip. Okay. Here. Okay. Maybe turn it 
that direction? Yeah. Who's this? Oh, hi, Barry. Right. Okay. Goats are probably going to knock it over. Well, they'll be right, I think, when we're settled. Ruby. Oh, that's Ruby. And <laughs> Philip. Really? Obviously, Philip. I might have treats, guys. <laughs> oh. oh, hello. Do you want a treat? Philip, do you want a treat? Let's turn that a little bit. Oh, what's this? So at the moment, Ruby's exploring the camera. Um, Americans usually mispronounced as Adidas rather than Adidas. Ah, Adidas. Oh, yeah, OK. A uh, bit late to the party tonight. Yeah, absolutely. What's going on? Uh, no, it wasn't a fart. That was um, the goats do this... They like blow a raspberry. Yeah. They just sort of like go. <laughs> it's really funny. Oh, oh thank you, Nancy. Nancy. Um, Katrina. Katrina thank oh, you wow. Thank you very much. That's very generous of you. Thank you. Um, where are we? Baz, my man, looking good. <laughs> yeah, he is. He's looking really good. Oh, let's have a look. I'll try and lift it up a little bit. I don't want to move the camera too much because the connection goes bad. Is the picture still okay, guys? Yeah, his, uh, his sunburn's looking much better. Uh, it's getting there. It's still a bit dry, but it's going to take a while. Oh, oh Debbie. Thank, you, thank Debbie. you, Debbie. Oh, what's this? You're both a lovely couple. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. <laughs> Rachel's not too bad. Going to lower it down a bit. Picture's great. Oh, good. Right, OK, lower it down. OK. How's that? Uh, what's happened here? It's very loose. Oh, it's because that's it's tightening up. Okay. That's all the treats we have for you guys. Right. Uh, Philip. Hello. Hello. Don't bite my fingers. No, don't bite my fingers. Oh, Phil. What are you doing, man? <laughs> Philip. To be Philip, no. Stage. <laughs> okay. Right, there's nothing left in you there. You eat this. Yeah, you can eat that. And you keep quiet. There All right. Good. You want this one, Ruby? Good boy. How long until Barry has his bits and bobs seen to? Well, um, I think uh, probably within the next couple of weeks. Yeah. We'll speak to the vet's meant to be coming out this coming week, so we'll try and make an appointment then. Yeah. Rachel, did you rescue Julie? <laughs> 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 she did actually. Uh, hi from East Ham, London. Barry is looking so chilled. Oh right. Do you want to see Billy? East Ham. Is that uh, we were? I was watching the boxing last night. Oh, thank you, Tracy. Thank you, Tracy. <laughs> oh. Barry isn't doing the bitey bite. He's a nibbly. Nib yeah, he does actually. He is. He is a bit bitey bite. You have to watch him. He's got a very, very manipulative little top lip. It's quite funny. This goat It's like is a little finger. Skunk, this guy. <laughs> He's very friendly as well. But I don't think I have any treats left for him. Don't talk about Barry's bits and bobs in front of him. Yeah, I know, I kept, felt a little bit bad there. <laughs> yeah, he's, um, he, is, he has changed. He's changed a lot in his, um, his attitude. He is quite trusting, um, but it's sort of, it's a little, it goes both ways, actually. It's just as we're getting to know each other. Um, he's a little bit bitey, but if I turn the camera that way a little bit. He doesn't particularly like the camera, funnily enough. I've got a video going up this week, um, which you'll see, and he sort of runs away from the camera. You are early. Hello from Oregon. Yeah, we are early. We're getting earlier now because of... Um, it gets uh, darker sooner. Yeah, it gets darker sooner. And also we're, because the temperature's just dropped a little bit, although you wouldn't believe it today. It was crazy. Um, it's just uh, it's made a bit of a difference on that. Oh, we should just quickly say, say hello, guys. <laughs> uh, we, <laughs> this is Ellie and Susanna who are volunteering with us and uh, at the moment. So... Uh, they are just having a wander around. You okay, guys? <laughs> getting away, getting away from the animals. <laughs> right. Uh, okay. There we go. 
Hello, greetings from Germany. Hello, Sabine. Sabina or Sabine? Okay. Oh, my ankle. Yeah. Uh, Barry's just exploring the camera at the moment. We saw you in post. Mm -hmm. Thank you for helping with all the heartbeats. Yeah. <laughs> Hello from Jacksonville, Florida. I, from New Zealand. Uh, where did Philip Valentino's name come from? Oh. Well, we did um, we did a a, a you know a competition, not a competition, you know, like uh, like we did with name Barry. We did the same for the goat. So it was like put a pound in the pot and suggest a name, and then it went to a poll, and Valentino was the winner. Um, but also at the same time, Philip um, was suggested as after Black Philip from the film The Witch. And um, that kind of stuck. We started calling him it as a joke, really. <laughs> yeah, and then it's kind of stuck, so he became Philip Valentino. Mm -hmm. Hello, Amsterdam. Oh, hello, hello. Look, that's it. not really a lot of, not that. very interesting, is it? With, there we go, that might be a bit better. You can see you a bit better now. I can't see the... Right, Philip, what are you doing? I've got to say... Uh, Mijas at the moment. Oh, you're in Mijas. Uh, hi from Surrey and thank you for showing... Uh-oh. Uh, hello, Sue Latin. Oh, hi from Oregon. Curious about... Sorry, I missed that one. The whale tail necklace. Uh, it was just a gift from my grandparents, I think, for my um, 18th birthday. Hi from Houston, Texas. Love you guys. Happy Sunday from Miami Beach, Florida. Ah oh, well, happy Sunday to you guys too. Um, uh, oh my goodness! Oh, Philip. thanks. Oh, Philip, no, you're too big to do that. No. Yeah, that is Barry, by the way. Right, should we? We we haven't got a lot of um, battery uh, oh. on the on this phone because I did a stupid thing and realised I hadn't charged it, and I've been using it all day. So, um, uh, lots of Canadians here. Leeds just dropping in. Hi, Leeds, just dropping in. <laughs> Hi from Pennsylvania. Donkey uh, quilt will be in the mail tomorrow morning. Thank you very much. We look forward to receiving it. Yeah, um, lovely. Valerie, you made it. Amazing. Hi, Valerie. <laughs> Ronnie right. time, please. Some Ronnie time. Okay, let's go and see Ronnie and Steve and everybody because we haven't got a lot of things. Okay, Phil, right. Okay. <laughs> Get <it off. laughs> Weirdo. Okay, let's go. See you later, Barry. We're gonna go and see Steve. Oh, where are you doing? Attack <laughs> <laughs> by Phil. Okay. All right, guys. Picture might go a bit funny again. I'm gonna try a different one. Oh. Okay. Right, I'm gonna hopefully we won't lose you. Uh, let's have a look here. So this is uh, on the road down to the main field. That's the horse field over there behind us. And then it goes all the way round. And then basically if I lift it up, you might be able to see a bit more. But they, the horses are all down there, which is where they tend to get fed. And then, um, hold on. And then, um, but during the day, oh, thank you, Pam. Thank you very much. Thanks, Pam. Um, I'll hold it. And then during the day, uh, they basically, they can free roam. So we have like a track system here so they can free roam and go where they want to. Do Barry and the goats like the new run? Yeah, they do. They're much happier, actually. Barry, uh, uh, Mufasa, when it was first put up, he didn't realize that the run was there and uh, he ran into it and he knocked it over and Barry and Ruby ran away. So um, that was quite exciting. Uh, and it was actually quite a good little test because Barry ran to the other donkeys and he was okay with them. But unfortunately he can't be left with them at the moment, obviously because he's intact and we don't want to end up with lots of pregnant horses and pregnant donkeys. So he had to be put back, but um, yeah, it was okay. Are you coming in? Um, uh, mm. Mm, okay. Dotty. Oh. 
Right. Let's do this. Oh, all right. They're all eating, obviously, this time of night. I don't know. So dark already. Okay. So that should get better now with that picture. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Little dance. Poops. The poops. Yes, just, Steve. I'll just write that area. Steve, you're live. Do you want to say hello? Good boy. Steve. You're a good boy, aren't you? What's that there? Nothing. Nothing. You're raking up your poops all the time. Constantly raking up poops. All right, all right. Can I just read the people's comments? Steve. 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 Hold on, I'll come and join you. He's, don't move, I've just no, right there. No, he's being a bit. Okay. He's trying to have a good scratch. Oh yeah, well put put it down. I'll come over and scratch on it. Oh my Steve, goodness, you're Steve, gonna have knocked Steve. me over. Come here, come here, come here, come here. You wanna rub? You wanna scratch? Here you go. Okay. Right. You are too big. <laughs> Your big head. It's everywhere. Yeah, I have a little scratch in the ears. Uh, no, we don't have any birds at the moment, Sharon. Um, we've got a large... Turn the camera a little bit so you can see him. <laughs> oh, no, here. We've got a large local fox population, so we don't have an area specifically <laughs> um, <laughs> secure for birds. Put it on the end of his nose, the camera, so you can see oh. it looks happy his face. Uh, hang on. <laughs> oh, this <laughs> my. I know he's really funny. He's enjoying that. What's this? What's this? <laughs> Steve's enjoying his little evening massage. Oh. Is that better? Is that better? Okay. Right. Uh, Are you the official landowners now? Uh, not, not officially, yet. not yet. Almost, almost. <sighs> okay. Um, can someone knock on Val's door? <laughs> I think Val's here. Yeah, I thought I did see Valerie. I think she is here. Where are your volunteers from? They're from the UK, from England. Yeah. Do you have to watch out for snakes? I haven't actually seen. We found that little one, didn't we? There found that little, little one. one. Yeah, yeah. there haven't really really seen many. Usually, Just... you see them like sunbathing, don't you? Yeah, it's the wrong time of year. The snakes normally quite early in the like year spring. when it starts getting yeah spring. You normally see them on the road and things like that when they're trying to heat up. Don't bite. Don't no. Bite. Nibbly. If we come to volunteer, do we get head scratches too? <laughs> yeah, if you want. <laughs> <laughs> Love your t-shirt, it's also my favourite breed. Yeah, this, um, oh, you can't see it now. But I got it from uh, Tracy, who's in the live tonight, who's a very wonderful supporter who's been here. <laughs> Thank you very much, Cindy. Thank you, Cindy. When will you own the property? Well, just as soon as all the paperwork's done and uh, we've crossed all the T's and dotted the I's. Um, we've got a situation at the moment where we've got... All right, Steve, hold on a minute, mate. We're just having a little chat. Um, uh, we've got to... Uh, Ronnie? Ronnie? Okay. Um, yeah, we've got... A, we're trying to work out at the moment the tax element of it. So that was the one thing that was unknown. Um, so that's that's part of it. So that might be a little bit of a delay to it because there's um, obviously you've got to pay the tax man. So we've got to make sure that we're we're not uh, overpaying or underpaying and stuff like that. And I don't really know how it works, but it's to do with how they what 
We're just talking about tax. I know. It's disgusting, isn't it? But we've got to pay it. Um, so, yeah, that's basically one of the hold-ups at the minute. Yeah, and we want to get some checks done on the house as well. Yeah. Ronnie. Ronnie. <laughs> don't do it, man. Uh, how far away is the volcano from you? Oh, it's a long way away. Um, it's in uh, La Palma, which is in on the Canary Islands, I believe. Yeah. Um, and that's off the coast of Africa. Um, so that's off the west coast of Africa. So that's a long way from it. It's the other side and it's down into um, where Mediterranean side, uh, which is on the east side of Spain. And uh, the, uh -huh. the volcanoes on the west side down uh, off, the, off the west coast of Africa, I believe. If my geography is correct. Steve. Um, hello. Steve's getting a bit. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Um, uh, Ronnie. Ronnie, that's, that's not too so helpful, <laughs> to be honest. We're trying to, uh, we're just trying to read the comments. And... Oh. Okay. No, Can no, we just, everybody no. just, hold Chill on a minute. Out. Hold on a minute. I'm going to have to send um, one of them away. Yeah, hold on. Right. You go over there. Right. Thank you. Right. You're welcome to join us for the live, right? But you can't stick your face and your whole body in the camera. <laughs> Or fight with Steve. Or fight with Steve. Okay, that's not what it is. All right, so here, this is fine. This distance, this works. This is good. All right, everyone can see you. We are all sharing the space and it's all good. All right, but any closer, we can't see anything except your face, which is beautiful as it is. It's not that interesting after a little while. Okay, all right, so we're just talking about. Stop tax, it, Django. Actually. So um, um, someone's asking for an update on the puppies. Uh, the puppies were rehomed, so uh, we didn't have to get involved in the end. Um, the guy that had the puppies managed to get them rehomed. All right, there, mate. All right, all right. Calm down. All right. Oh, okay. We're going there. Okay. Thank you very much, Lisa so, Larson, for your donation. Uh, okay. Oh, he wants a cuddle. Yeah. We've got a cuddle, Ronnie cuddle, going on at the moment. That's all he wants. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Steve. He's a bit jealous. Yeah, Steve's getting jealous now. Right, go, just go oh, and eat your dinner. Go and eat your dinner. Go on. Well, you could... Uh, oh, okay. Any, uh, other than flies, any bitchy... <laughs> bitchy what? Any flies? Any other bitchy comments? <laughs> other... Yeah, some right bitchy comments Bitey, the other day. Bitey, itchy bugs. <laughs> Bite, bitchy, bitchy bugs. bugs. <laughs> there was some such bitchy bugs. <laughs> Couldn't believe it. He flew in and said... Oh, I don't like your hair much. And then bit me. <laughs> and then another bitchy bug came Steve. in and said, oh, I don't like what you're wearing. Anyway. Oh, no, 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 Ronnie, leave it out. Ronnie, Ronnie, be nice. Be nice. Uh, mosquitoes, uh, midges. Bitey bugs. Just generally bitey <laughs> bugs. Yeah, right, they can right. get really bad in okay spring then? and uh, autumn. Yeah. God, oh, put, thank you, Linda. He's putting all his weight on me. Oh, you... <laughs> he is, oh. isn't he? Yeah, he really is. <sighs> Ronnie. Wondering want... how your local food shops are like. Is there organic products available? Uh, there yeah. are, but... It's just kind of like... Um, there's not really any, like, dedicated shops like that locally. It's more supermarkets with some organic stuff. There is a market, um, Spanish. Watch out, watch out. Steve, Steve. The Spanish towns have a market usually once a week. Um, so there is okay. that, but. Do you want, do you want to, should we go anywhere else? Do you want to move location? If you guys want to see, well, we've got the horses. Um, the pigs are all asleep now, really. Oh, oh no. Steve. That was Steve. Steve just scrolled to the bottom of the comments with his <laughs> ear. <laughs> right, stop this now. Right, yeah, I think we should get out of here now before. One of us gets murdered. Oh, thank you very much, Valerie. Thanks, Valerie. And I hope we didn't miss any more. Mm. Steve just ruined very, everything. Very, very handsome boy. If we yeah. missed your comments, just ask again because Steve just Keeps scrolled off the of screen. Them. Yeah. What about Prince? Prince and Prospero? Yeah, do you want to go and see Prince and Prospero? Let's see if it'll work. We might lose you, might not, don't know. Okay. It's getting dark. Oh, the temperature's dropping as well, which is nice. Right, excuse me, Dotty. Okay. Good girl. I might just, just pick up that poo while I'm here. Okay. We'll see Dotty then. Dotty's eating.
one less poo to pick up in the morning. <laughs> Do you uh, have to pick up all your supplies or are there any deliveries available to you? The, yeah, we get our, so we get our hay delivered, depending on the supplier, and we get our grains delivered, or we can just go into town and pick up like a sack of grain whenever we need it, but he will do a delivery for us. Um, as for like human food, they don't do that out here. Um, like in the, in, in rural areas. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Talking of midgets, I think they're out. Yeah. Do you want to take this because I need to sort of jump over there? Okay, here we go. Would you like to see Rachel no. go over an electric fence? Don't get zapped. Oh, did it get you? No. <laughs> that was so tempting just to Stop it. to raise it a little bit. Nice sky tonight. It's very, um, I don't know if you can see, but it's quite, uh, it's quite pink over the ridge. Uh, I don't know if you can see that in the background. I don't know if it will come out on this, but there, whoop, there is Moolah Castle. And that's, that's the castle that was built in the 15th century. I don't know. Built in the fifth. In fact, I think the original castle was built in the 13th century, and then it was revised, and then built in the 15th century, or rebuilt in the 15th century, and then again, I think, in the 18th. So it's had a few. Um, had quite a part. I tell you what, we'll do. One day we'll go up to the castle, and I'll give you a little history lesson of the local <laughs> castle. That'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Not. Actually, there's another one as well. There's a real, real old castle. It's even older than that one, and that's. Um, that's not far from here, so I'll have to show you that one as well. There's lots of history around here and old Roman villas and things like that. That pig's made a really good bed. <laughs> okay, so, uh, don't know, hopefully we've still got a picture. Come on. Come on in. Okay. Hello. So, Prince and Prospero. I can't see the comments. Oh, I'll have to get my glasses. I shall sit here. This picture is great. Is there much of a Moroccan influence yeah. there? E.g. pretty tiling. Um, it's mostly, as you'd expect, like Spanish. There are some Moroccan influenced buildings. Um, but it's Can not... Can we see you? No, we don't want to see you. No, not me, but the horses. <laughs> yeah, the you horses can see them. Yeah. Someone said, who's the pig? That's me, actually. <laughs> I'm not a pig, but thanks. Uh, there's a little... Who's the pig with the t-shirt on? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, we've got... That's Patch. Patch and... Is that Winnie? I can't see. Winnie! Winnie. No, it's not. Look at these pigs that are all, all in a line having a little no, sleep. Sorry. Can you see them? You'll see Prospero's bum now and how fat he is. Here's a... Um, oh no, that's... I actually think we should come out of here because we're going to disturb them. Okay. Because the pigs are setting down for the night. I'll just see Prince over here. Sorry guys, I didn't want to disturb the pigs too much. Okay. Because they yeah. get quite... Um, Do you want to see Alfie over the fence? Uh, Over yeah. the other fence. Yeah. Okay. Oh, shush, Django. Okay, we're going to see Alfie, my friend and yours. He's a friend to everyone, Alfie. Just don't go in there unprepared. Because it can get a little bit serious. Okay, so this is Polly. Polly the pig. Oh, I think we might lose you in a minute. We're down to 5% battery. So if we lose you guys... Then we're sorry. Then we're we sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're not... Alfie. And then Alfie's Alfie... Eating. Alfie's eating, is he? Yeah, he's eating. He's oh yeah, there's Alfie there. And... All right, Polly. Polly's a bit stinky. <laughs> 
Ah, oh, that's nice. Picture okay, good. Uh, is the TENS unit working better? Um, we're still struggling to get it on the... Uh, should we go this way? Yeah, Yeah. Well, I don't think we've got much time because I think we're going to lose, lose the phone in a minute. Here, do you want to take that? I need to close this up. Yes, please, for the tour of the castle. Oh, okay. We can do that. How do you tell the age of a donkey? Since you're asking them, how do you know the age of the donkey? So the vet can guess roughly by looking at a horse's or a donkey's teeth, how old they are. But it is a, like a rough guess. Um, but yeah, that's the best way to tell. Remember to smash that like button, guys. Can you get... If I go in? Yep. Whoa, okay. Right. Definitely getting dark in here. <laughs> it's getting dark on the screen as well. Cause of the I know, because the battery is going, yeah. Should we go and see Jacob? Yeah. Jacob obviously is the namesake of the sanctuary. If you run out of battery whilst yeah. this is on, will it save it or not? Don't know. Okay. Probably not actually. So we should, so we should just say good night. Okay, well we'll show Jacob and then we're gonna say good night because we're gonna lose the the power. Hello, handsome. So this is Jacob. This is the namesake of the sanctuary. This is why it's called Jacob's Ridge. And uh, Jacob came to us when he was about two years old. He was a rescue, originally rescued by the very good people at Easy Horse Care Rescue Center. And um, if you don't follow them, look them up, Easy Horse Care Rescue Center. They do a fripping amazing job. Um, and they do lots of horse rescues and things Gee. like that. And uh, they totally inspired me to start Jacob's Ridge. Um, so yeah, be sure to, uh, to look them up and, uh, and follow them. They do tremendous work. And that's uh, run by Sue and Rod Weeding. And uh, they're just uh, absolutely amazing. Love them to bits. <laughs> so Jacob, Jacob's quite mouthy. <laughs> right, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to say goodnight now. And um, because we're going to close this down before my battery collapses. Um, so thank you very much for joining us for this live. Sorry, it's a short one tonight, guys. And let us know in the comments if you like this format, if you prefer it when we go around and see all the different animals. I'm suspecting you probably do. I think it's a bit more interesting than us just sitting there and just chatting away. A little bit different. But anyway, let us know. Give us your feedback. Remember to hit the like button, please. And uh, it makes a big old difference. Uh, oh, gone. I don't know what it will do. Oh, thank you. Hi guys, uh, sorry about that. We lost um, complete connection there, we lost everything. So um, if you're still watching, sorry about that. That's well, the end of it. Still and, watching, um, sorry about that. That's well, the end of it. Going, going, feedback and everything else. It's all gone horribly wrong. So uh, uh, we'll that's see that's you next week that's and you'll see us throughout the week wrong. as well. So, uh, well, 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 thank you so much for this watch. Thank you very much for your super chats. And we'll see you next week. Okay, see you later. What's going on with sound? <laughs>